We'll guide you through how to download and install Lightmatica in Minecraft 1.21.5. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. Lightmatica is really useful for doing builds amongst many other things in Minecraft. So we'll guide you through how you can go and get it in the game. To go and get started, we need to come and close out of it. Go and open up a web browser of your choice. In this case, I'll use Chrome. What we can do is go and type it in like so. I'll go and add Minecraft to the end just to make sure we find it. We can come to modrinth.com. Now you can go and read about it. It's going to go and give you some useful information about different things and it's worth reading for essentially. Now to go and download it, we can press versions at the top. We can go and see the most up-to-date version is currently 1.21.5, which is what we want. And we can go and see the platform is for Fabric. This is essentially the mod loader. So we're going to be using a Fabric mod loader. I'll guide you through that. We can go and press the download button over to the right and it's now downloaded. So now what we need to do is we need to go and head back to Google and we need to go and get Fabric. So what you can do is go and search for Fabric Minecraft. I recently have, which makes it easy. We can come to fabricmc.net. At the top, you want to press download and you'll see the download for Windows button. You can go and click there and it will download. And then what we need to do is go and get the Fabric API as well. So we can click that there. We brought to a site called CurseForge. There are loads of different mods on here and we can press files. Now what we need to do is make sure we get it for the right version. The best way to do this is by using the filter. Select that there and we can select 1.21.5. Now we can come down this list and we can go and see the different options here and we can go and get the most recent one which is at the top here and press download file. That's now gone and downloaded. So we've now downloaded what we need. Before we start the install process, a big thank you to Apex for sponsoring this video. At the moment you can get 30% off your first invoice. If you're interested there'll be a link down below in the pinned comment and the description. Apex has got so many great features. For example, one click install more packs, DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support. And you can go and get support when you need it for the 24 seven live chat, which is really useful. Ultra latency, giving you a smooth experience amongst many other things as well. So if you're interested, there'll be a link down below. Now let's go and install it. So what you need to do is come to the bottom and open up the downloads folder in your file explorer. We need to go and find the fabric installer and double click on it. What's super key here is we install Fabric for the right version, which in this case is 1.21.5. We can go and press install like so, and it's that simple. Now we need to go and open up the Minecraft launcher. At the top, go and press installations, and we can scroll down and go and find Fabric Loader for 1.21.5. Press the folder icon to the right, and this will open up. What we need to do is go and find the mod folder, so we can scroll down and open it up. In here, we need to go and add in Lightmatica. So come back to our downloads, drag and drop it in, and also go and add in the Fabric API as well. We're also gonna need one more thing. So open up a web browser and come to Google, and you want to go and type in M-A-L-I-L-I-B, Mali Lib, like so, and we can add Fabric to the end. What we can do is then come to Modrinth, like so, and we want to press versions at the top. What we need to do is go and get it for 1.21.5. Press the download button to the right and it's now downloaded. Now we can stay here, but we need to come to our downloads folder. Let me just go and refresh it. And what we can then do is drag and drop this in. This is needed for Lightmatica to work. What you can do is then hover over the fabric loader and press play like so over to the right. Here we are in the world. Just to show you, I'm using Lightmatica. When you press M, it goes and opens up. And also when we go and use a stick, we can go and start using it. Hold control to go through the different modes. For example, I could go and I could right click and I could then go and right click somewhere else and go and start making different zones. It's that simple. 